Um, hello everyone, this is the seventh part of this three-year glitched speedrun tutorial and today we will be looking at how to do Ice Cap 1 quickly as Sonic and Tails. So basically for like 20 seconds you don't do anything and if you jump here in this cutscene then you will potentially um, go slower if you don't know where to jump. Um, so it is better to not jump, so now you piano roll, do a drop dash, then a 6 tap, then break this wall by drop dashing and rolling, and now go down here, do a peel out, and then roll, um, though you don't wanna, you don't wanna get frozen, which I unfortunately did, um, now you wanna, um, look for when Sonic gets pushed back, um, this is just one of the cues that you can use, and the people usually don't use this cue. Um, and I didn't come up with any of this yet again, as always. Um, so shoutouts to the community. Um, but anyway, um, after Sonic gets pushed back, you want to wait a little bit and then start holding right. And if it goes right, you'll be able to get slow glitch. Um, so. I'm gonna show a clip of me actually getting slope glitch, and yeah. So that is how you get slope glitch, and now you wanna land onto an upcoming slope, then jump off it, and then hold the left, like this. And then Sonic is gonna rise three times while he's on that slope, and then you wanna roll after he rises for a second time. So, now you wanna start holding left as soon as Sonic picks up some ranks here. And if you do it right, um, you'll make it there and die. Though since I didn't have enough lives, I got a game over, so I will show off what it is like to basically die there and then get to the boss room. Um, so that is essentially what people usually do when yellowing this level. And now, you can either use Raffle Mirror Strat on this bus, or just get right beside the bus and then bounce on it six times. And either strat works. Um, though, if you're getting to a checkpoint at the beginning, you can't do the dead warp. Um, but if you do get to the checkpoint at the beginning, then you can basically retry getting slope glitch a lot faster than, than if you didn't get to the checkpoint. Um, so this is what you do if you're getting to the checkpoint. So essentially you hit this checkpoint here, and then the rest of the level as usual, but there is a specific point where you want to jump off. Um, And as you can see, um, I messed it up, but this is why the checkpoint comes in handy for not having to watch the, the cutscene at the beginning. Um, so you do this as usual. But then once you see this, you want a piano roll. And... Basically, you will either make it to Sonic's bus or Knuckles' bus. Um, but then, if you're, if you're going to Sonic's bus, then you wanna hit. You wanna touch a red spring from above in order to do slope glitch. Or if you're doing Knuckles' bus, then you wanna hit this with in order to do slow glitch. Um, and now you can just do the bus as usual, though if you're doing Knuckles bus, then it is easier to hit it than if you're doing Sonic's bus. Because Knuckles bus basically goes lower 
it basically goes a bit lower than Sonic's boss, so you can actually hit it with the Insta Shield. Um, and essentially, if you if you basically do Knuckles boss, you wanna restart checkpoint. So. If you're doing Sonic's bus, you don't need to restart checkpoint, but yeah. Um, so now we are gonna look over how to do the level without any glitches at all. So instead of getting slow glitch, you surely a peel out here, and after the second ice wall is broken by, by the thing you're standing on, then you wanna release the peel out. And now you... It's through this entire level with the help of the lightning shield. Um, and basically that's why that's what the rest to it. Um So essentially you can do this as a backup if you miss low glitch and don't wanna try to get it again. And it loses a little under a minute. So it isn't actually that bad. Um and this is yet again something that other people came up with. Um essentially this is the glitchless route using glitchless runs. So yeah. So now you make it to a boss and you can either bounce on the boss by using the lightning shield or by using tails. Um, so you just do this and there you go. That is Ice Cap 1, essentially. Um, so that is essentially all the rest to it. And uh, not quite there, um, that jump is probably not possible, but I don't know, I don't even know why I even tried that out, uh, but yeah, that is essentially all the rest to Ice Cap 1.